Hi, my name is Glenn Cartwright. I'm the nursery manager here at the Glass House Nursery in Chatham. I just want to mention that this is the time of year we want to be a little bit on guard, watching for lots of those little bugs and critters that get into our gardens and can actually cause a lot of damage. I mean, one day you look, the garden's absolutely beautiful, you go through the next day for a walk, and next thing you know you've got aphids, you've got bugs, you've got caterpillars, you name it. It's two that you should be watching out for this at this particular time of year are, of course, uh, aphids. The aphids are little tiny sucking insects. They can be white, they can be green, they can be black, they can be yellow. You find them on the undersides, the leaves, on the stems of plants, and they literally suck the living juice out of your plants. You find them on everything from perennials to trees to shrubs, you name it. Another thing we have to watch out for this time of year, and it's fairly prevalent, are spruce budworm and soft fly larvae. Now the spruce budworm is particularly bad in spruce and fir in our area. The soft fly larvae tends to specialize in pine trees. Now that's not just the large forest trees. All of your ornamental spruce, pines, and firs in your garden that you paid a lot of money for, spent a lot of time looking after, can be devastated overnight by a small infestation of some of these larvae. If you're not sure, go out and check in the garden. If you're not sure, get a little Ziploc bag, take a sample of the insect, put it inside, zip it nice and tight, and come in and see us. We've got lots of expert staff who will be glad to help you identify the particular insect you've got or particular critter that's causing problems. And we have many, many solutions we can recommend. Just for instance, there's a little product called BT. Now that stands for Bacillus thuringiensis. Now that is a bacteria. It's totally harmless to animals and human life. That you can spray on your plants. It will help to get rid of caterpillars, control them. We also have a few other items like Dr. Doom products. You can actually spray on the caterpillars and aphids will kill them on contact. So there are lots of solutions we have on hand. You don't have to despair. If you're not sure what the problem is, whether it's aphids, spruce budworm, soft fly in, uh, larvae, again, take a sample, put it in a baggie, bring it in to see us. We'll be glad to help identify it and point you in the right direction to find the perfect solution for all your insect control needs. So, tune in next week for our next video, which is going to center on Japanese beetles and spider mites, what to look for, how to find them, and how to control them.